Hello again from the surgy waters of Aliwo Shoal, a rocky reef based not far from the city of Durban in South Africa. It is not really a tropical coral reef, and yet it provides some fantastic marine life sightings. Most of the reef grows around a long, rocky ridge, which surface is mostly covered by various algae, which has been known to fight over space with corals. In this place you can see this battle for space with a naked eye, as clearly all the corals live inside potholes, while algae grows over the rocks. Nevertheless, many species of fish thrive in this plant-based environment. You get to see many grazing species, for example, like a bunch of quite rare and region-specific South African zebrafish, with a name fit for the African continent. Or a school of silver rabbit fish picking up organic matter from the greenery. In amongst the algae, a very interesting creature can be seen lurking. The biggest of the shrimp kind, a close to 20 cm mantis shrimp, is hunting. While cruising down over the sandy patches of reef in Alawal, if you look closely you can find a bizarre kind of fish. Moving like a leaf in the water, this is a small razor ass, who gave me quite a surprise by ducking down into the sand at some point, a behavior I haven't seen before. Reef on this shore is full of small caves where one or two people can maybe squeeze in. These dark places are a home for quite a few and yet very rare small fish. A whole family of bright yellow pineapple fish resides in one of these caves. These armored animals can live in the same cave for many many years, giving the opportunity to see them over many seasons. Yet another interesting creature added to the collection of sightings. One of the main reasons that algae is so prevailing here is generally worse visibility, hence the green hue on many days. There is not enough sunlight getting to the bottom for corals to thrive as much as they do on an average tropical coral reef. For many species, including turtles, this is not an obstacle and they still enjoy this place very much. I must say that I have probably seen more turtles here than in many other places I have dived before. Including a rather unique situation between two turtles that I have witnessed. This is what you would call a territorial dispute between two loggerhead turtles. Unlike other species, this one is known to fight for its feeding grounds. While filming this shot, I got really excited as something really rare was probably going to develop. I stayed at a distance to not disturb them. Unfortunately, a fellow diver ruined the whole thing by swimming in too close and getting the angry turtle's attention. The person probably got a fright seeing turtles snapping jaws. Note for the future? There is no point in aggressively chasing pictures of nature. Patience is the key to success. In regards to angry turtles, I also had a different encounter here. Another one of loggerhead turtles chased away one of my fellow divers, who was on its path. That gave me a little laugh. 